Hi, I'm Kristen from POS Nation. Today, we're gonna to talk about the most traditional components of a POS system. This is a cash drawer. It's used to hold and store all cash. Although we're on our way to a contactless and cashless consumer economy, cash drawers are still a vital part of the POS system. A cash drawer has different compartments that hold bills and coins. This allows cashiers to efficiently count change. Cash drawers take the brunt of everyday wear and tear, so it's common to replace tills, mounts, and keys. To break it down further, the till is a plastic piece that's inserted inside the cash drawer that holds the cash and coins. Mounting brackets can be used to put the cash drawer in a more secure and permanent location within your store. The keys can be used to access the inside of the cash drawer when you're not processing a sale. On the setup side, the cash drawer has a cable that's directly connected into the back of your receipt printer. It also looks like a phone cable. When a cash transaction is completed, it'll print a receipt and the cash drawer will open. If the cash drawer is not opening, it could be due to the cable not being plugged correctly into the back of your receipt printer. To increase productivity, we recommend having a two-till cash drawer system. Many small businesses will do drawer counts at the end of their shifts, even if they're still serving customers. And to avoid downtime while counting the drawer, retailers can simply swap the till in and out and keep running their business. At the end of the day, all cash drawers are pretty much the same. They can offer different dimensions, different materials, but they all serve the same purpose. The point of sale market can be very overwhelming, and we hope that this intro to cash drawers really helps your search. If you're new to retail and not sure where to begin, check out our free POS Nation Buyer's Guide in the description below. Thanks for watching.